Hey guys, this is Eric Creel, the Trolls World Tour Fanboy 2002. And let's do a review on How to Train Your Dragon, which came out in 2010. Let's get started. So the plot, we have Hiccup, who want to find a way to catch some dragons. But except Hic Hiccup's new dragon named Toothless. And then when basically happens is when Toothless is the Night Fury. And it pretty much happens is they want to keep the dragon friendly because Hiccup wants to help dragons because they are friendly and they are nice in the battle stadium thing. And it's pretty much happens is they need to take care of the dragons at all costs. And it's basically happens is when Hiccup needs to demonstrate to Toothless to give it a good fly. And then... Hiccup and Astrid wants to take a test drive to fly. And then basically what happens is when Hiccup and Toothless need to help by helping from the Burke people. And then basically what happens is when Hiccup and Toothless need to find a way to... And then basically what happens is when Hiccup's dad need to take Toothless back. And then basically when... The villain dragon wants to kidnap all the Burke people. And then when suddenly when Hiccup needs to find Toothless and all costs and they give it a fly to defeat the villain dragon. And then basically what happens is soon as Hiccup's leg got broke as soon need to help to stand up and walk and whatever they want. And then soon as the Burke people finds a new Burke home for dragons, and then Hiccup give a big happy ending and Hiccup finally gets a new girlfriend named Astrid. And then that's it. What do I think of How to Train Your Dragon? Which is an introduction to the How to Train Your Dragon trilogy. It's really awesome! So the first time I watched that as a kid, as an eight-year-old, and then I finally give it a rewatch on Blu-ray at my PlayStation 4 Pro in every six days ago. And then, what do I heard of it? It's awesome! So, How to Train Your Dragon is one of the best films in 2010. It's up there with Toy Story 3, Inception, Despicable Me, Tangled, Mega Mind. And Shrek Forever After are equivalent or one of the best films that already came out in the year of 2010. The animation looked really awesome for a 2010 animated feature. The story, very cool. And the characters, we have Hiccup, the main character. He is awesome! And then we have Toothless, which is a main dragon character. He's amazing! The best character of this the entire film. And then we have Astrid. She's awesome! Including Hiccup's dad. He's awesome. And including the rest of the Burke people are so awesome. Including Tough Nut and Rough Nut, played by T.J. Miller and Christian Wig. They're funny. And the rest of the characters and the dragons are so awesome. Including the John Powell music score. It is so awesome. Do I have issues and negatives? Nope. It's an awesome film and it easily gets a 10 out of 10. Amazing, brilliant masterpiece. And it gets the seal of epic masterpiece. So... Hope you all enjoy and tell me what do you think of How to Train Your Dragon. Whether you like it or not. So comment below and hope you all enjoy and bye!